this video is going to alienate many of my subscribers. If you're going to be triggered by this video, which many people are, and many people are going to think I'm an idiot, and many people are going to think that I'm not whatever. If you don't like it, go away. But I have just come out of McDonald's because I was eating a double sausage and egg McMuffin meal. And yesterday for dinner, I had a double quarter pounder with cheese meal at McDonald's. And I'm gonna only eat fast food from McDonald's, Burger King, all these places, and only drink fizzy drinks like Coke and Pepsi for as long as I can in as much quantity as I want and I'm doing it for the purpose of exploring 5D consciousness. Now I know that that sounds fucking insane. Like what are you talking about? Fucking McDonald's 5D consciousness. Well, I made a video before saying how I believe that fast food, like Domino's Pizza and McDonald's and all this, contain like ascension vibrations and there's stuff in it that's awakening us. And I deleted it due to self-doubt and poor video reception. I've got a lot of comments saying, you know, like I'm basically an idiot. Let me get away from this busy road. And, and I've been like teeter-tottering between eating healthy, quote unquote healthy, like fruit, vegetables, all this, and processed foods. And I'm ready to go all in on the processed foods because I've been saying it for ages, not to many people, but these foods hold extreme power. They, have, they hold an extremely otherworldly vibration. And there's a guy called Wiley Brooks. He's a breatharian, look him up. Type Wiley Brooks into YouTube and listen to what he has to say. And everything, I found him yesterday, and everything he's saying has confirmed the things that I already thought about fast food in that humans are 5D creatures and we are spiritual beings and that we've fallen from that state into the 3D world. So anything you consume from the 3D world, including fruits and vegetables that grow on the trees here in the 3D world, are gonna bind you to it. And according to this guy, which again, Wiley Brooks, you can look him up, According to Wiley Brooks, McDonald's and, well, he says just McDonald's, but he, the interview was from a long time ago. I think it's evolved since then, to be honest. But he says that these foods hold the 5D vibration and they're actually, they're actually like ascension foods. And, and I as well, for a long time, I've been thinking, I've never spoke about this on video, but I might as well speak about it now. There's an awakening happening, right? Everybody's talking about the Great Awakening and all of this. And there's a concerted effort to stop it, like by the powers that be. But what if the awakening is McDonald's and all of these foods and they're awakening us and then the concerted effort is trying to convince us to eat healthy food. I know how nuts this sounds. This is fucking nuts. But just bear with me. Anyone who's a truth seeker, a true one, not like a fake one who just wants to hear what they already believe, but someone who's really looking for the truth, I know that there are people listening to me right now going, maybe he's on to something. Like, and, and then you're ex like, excited or interested to see where it goes. I'm gonna only eat fast food and only drink like Pepsi and Coke. I'm not gonna drink any water. I'm not gonna eat any fruit. I'm not gonna eat any vegetables. I'm, not, I'm only having like Doritos, because I think Doritos and all the big brand stuff, basically, I think they hold the vibration, like the 5D vibration. And I can feel it in my body. 
when I drink loads of fruit juice, like, I get heavy and like, I can't breathe properly. Like it blocks my breathing. McDonald's, I know I just made a video saying about the breath. When I eat McDonald's, it opens everything up. It's crazy. I just had a double sausage and egg McMuffin meal. I've got so much fucking energy right now and I feel great. I've, and like yesterday I had a double quarter pounder and I just feel great. And I know what you're gonna say. You're gonna say, well, there are people eating McDonald's every day and they're fat and unhealthy. It's like, yes, because they're eating it emotionally. I'm eating it for the purpose of spiritual exploration and, and ascension. It's very different. Intent is everything. And like, I'll give you a few more examples, if you like, about how the world is being woken up in secret. So they've given us McDonald's, they've given us Burger King, they've given us all these foods like Doritos and all of this stuff, right? And then they've put all this subliminal stuff in the movies. Like, they say that, oh, all the movies just have predictive programming. They have to tell you what they do before they do it, blah, blah, blah. It's like, no, they're making movies to wake us up because we're in such a sleepy state. Like, look at your grandparents and your parents compared to you. How much more awake are you than them? And you've eaten loads of processed food and they don't eat it. So what does that say about processed food? Like, they're still fat and unhealthy and sick and got cancer, and they didn't grow up with this processed foods, but we're growing up with it, and we are more awake than them. So, and like, we've got the internet. Like, people say, oh, the internet is a tool used to control us and brainwash us. It's like, no, it's not. I think how, how much progress have you made because of things you've learned on the internet? about waking up and diet and all of this wherever you are in your journey and because the internet and social media especially like instagram and all this are like powerful to, uh, like awakening tools and all of this stuff that we've been given fast food internet movies fucking all of this stuff that we think is bad we get told is bad it's actually awakening us and what else is interesting about this wiley brooks guy is he says that cows cows are a multi-dimensional being that have decided to incarnate here on earth to convert 3d matter aka grass into 5d flesh aka cow and we're supposed to eat it now vegan people are gonna have a big problem with this but it makes so much sense to me. Like there are people who eat nothing but carnivore and they, they are healthy. I don't care what anyone says. If you're denying that they, look, that they don't look healthy, then you're in dogma town. They look and are healthy. People like Jordan Peterson and his daughter, they're, they're like he fixed all his stuff from eating cow. And in India, cows are like sacred. And I, I know that this video is gonna be very, controversial among my subscribers here I know I don't have that many but I know I'm gonna lose some from this but whatever I don't want you if you're gonna go to be honest you if you're triggered by this sort of stuff <laughs> go away because you're not a good fit for the truth so <clears throat> I'm gonna document this I've just so last night for dinner I had double quarter pounder meal with fries and then I've just had double sausage and egg McMuffin meal with two hash browns and Diet Coke. I'm having Diet Coke with everything. So I'm just going to go for whatever I'm drawn to. And it's always going to be fast food, crisps, drinks, no water, no fruit. Um, and I'm going to do it for the purpose of exploring the vibration of the 5D consciousness that I know these foods contain. And I doubted myself before, but so I was like half in, half out. But now I'm all in, I'm, uh, I'm going all in. I'm gonna do this for as long as I can. I'm gonna see how I feel. I feel great right now, by the way. I feel, <laughs> mate, there is something to this. And like, I'm exploring it and you're not gonna hear, again, just another thing. You're not gonna hear this from anyone else because I'm crazy, I guess. Um, but yeah, I'll just, I'm gonna go, I'm just gonna, I'll probably make a video every day for it now just to see just so i can keep updating you i'll show you what i've eaten and stuff and it'll be fun so yeah stay tuned